Hey guys, what's up? Easy is everything, where everything is easy, and today I'm going to teach you how you can uh, get your iPod Touch or iPhone to display on your computer screen, um, just like this. Uh, this is only for Mac. Now, Windows is a little bit better than Mac, actually, because you can actually control it on your uh, computer screen, but uh, on the Mac, you can't control it. I'm trying to press, you know, it doesn't really work, but you can still do it on your iPod. It's very laggy though. Mac and Windows is really laggy, but you know, it gets the job done. Um, uh, what you'll need to do this, uh, I may go ahead and do a Windows tutorial. I've been saying that a lot. I don't want to do Windows tutorials and I really haven't been doing them. Um, that's actually because my Windows computer is down and I might have to do some stuff to get that back up. Camtasia is not doing so well. Um, but anyway, you're going to need a few programs, or two mainly, and on your iPod, one of them is a uh, screen splitter, and that is right here, in this little area right here, screen splitter. Okay, basically this lets you, uh, trans lets you display your iPhone or iPod Touch um, on a computer screen, like I'm doing right now, or if you have the right, uh, like, additions or cables, you can actually put it on your TV. Um, now, you will need to be jailbroken for this because we will need to go into Cydia to download Screen Splitter. So I'm going to open up Cydia, and while that's loading, I'm going to go ahead and teach you or tell you what program you need for uh, to get it to work on your computer screen. So on your computer, you need to download a program called iDemo, and that's right here. Okay, I, I demo, and I'll have a link in the description for that download. And basically, there's no installation really. You just download it, and it will be in your downloads folder, right here. Should be in here somewhere. Um, all right, let me let me search it because it's got to be here somewhere. I demo, M, M O. There we go. All right, um, downloads. So you should just get this little DMG and you just open it up. Okay, maybe there is a little bit of an installation, but you just click green all that, and that's it. Drag it to your applications. Okay, right, um, and there's a bunch. Uh, when you first install it, it will like need to register. So uh, there's a bunch of tutorial tutorials on YouTube where you can uh, register iDemo. If you don't register it, um, you can only uh, broadcast your iPod or, or your iDevice for one minute then it will shut off so that's terrible so obviously um, yeah you want it registered okay city is loaded up um, so we're just gonna go over here to search it should be under your main sources and we're gonna search for S C R E E N S P L Stop right there, because they spell splitter a little bit different. So let's lo let that load up. <sighs> this is what I mean by laggy. You see this little bar up here? That's going around a full time before it actually displays it again. All right, so uh, it's right here. Uh, screen splitter. Oh crap. Um. Well. I'll go ahead and pause it until that stops. Okay, and um, you should see uh, screen splitter. You see I spelled it a little bit different, but just install that. Um, you know, you get the little install up here. You'll press that. Once you have that installed, um, yeah, and you get iDemo installed, it's a matter of clicking on the screen splitter icon. Let me show you. 
It's a matter of clicking on this icon to where it says um, on up in the little notifications. It will look like it's loading. It will give the screen and then it will go right back to your home screen and it'll display this little on logo. Then open up iDemo and this is really uh, what it should look like. Let me go ahead and tap it to turn the screen splitter off. And uh, it'll look like this when you first open up uh, iDemo and when you click on the screen splitter icon you should see your uh, I forgot to mention you have to have Wi-Fi for this. Um, it, you should see your little detected devices. Just click on that and click on it. You should get a little window on your iPod or iDevice and click accept. And there you go. There you go. Um, that's about it. Uh, so yeah, guys, thanks for watching. And that's about it. Please rate, comment, subscribe, and remember, everything is easy.